Okay, there it is, the crop, 4K. It's getting close to Halloween, so it was time for me to check if my uh, surveillance system was working. I used a night owl. Uh, come on, focus on the night owl. A night owl. Man, this is the brand. A Night Owl uh, DVR AHD 10 is the video recorder. And the cameras, I'm not really sure what they are, but this was the black box Night Owl that I bought a few years ago at Costco. I bought this because my windows were broken on Halloween. Now, when I went to check it to make sure it was working for this Halloween, uh, I saw that um, it wasn't. When I went to the PC app, I saw three black screens, and when I went to check the uh, settings for the unit and that's the hard drive tab, it said that um, there was no hard drive. Now, this has happened to me two times before over the past three years. Here's how I keep my video recorder working. First problem, that which happened to me now, is the power brick. I've had two of them fail before, and what the symptoms are when the power brick fails, the hard drive disappears because there's not enough power or current to uh, make it move. So when I went outside and looked, uh, let me switch power packs here. I was greeted with this. The power light here is on. I've removed the cover of my unit, which I'll talk about in a few minutes. The fan was spinning, but we can't hear the hard drive spinning. In fact, it's pretty much dead because this, this brick is bad. And like I said before, it's not making enough uh, current to power this thing. So, you're going to need a spare power supply. I have this from some Chinese thing I bought. It is 12 volts at, trying to get it to focus here, 12 volts at 12 volts at 2 amps. This is what you need. Anything 1.5 amps or stronger at 12 volts will work. Let's plug this in. Okay, this is how your unit should sound. Okay, the unit is now working correctly. As you can hear, the hard drive is spinning. I can feel it and feel the vibrations. Uh, the fan is moving a little faster. And, of course, the power light is on. Now, when you try and communicate with the unit, you'll see, if you go to settings in the hard drive, it'll say it has a hard drive. And, of course, in my case, it's full, like it should be. And it'll say that... Um, on mine, at least, it shows that the last day to record a video was about two weeks ago. So that shows you how often I check it. Now on to the second part. Okay, the second part. Another issue is this unit overheats. The easiest way to fix this is to take the top cover off and put this unit in a larger case. The reason it overheats is because it only has three very small vents on the bottom. One, two, and three. That's not enough air vents to uh, cool this particular computer, which it is. It's a computer in there. Not enough vents to cool this computer off. So you take the top off. You take the top off and you put it in a larger box. And that will keep it cooler. You could also put a fan blowing air across it for the long term. But um, just like this has kept working for me for three years without having to send it in for any replacements. And that's that. Thank you. Please subscribe. <laughs>